guys, it's Jay. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. For those of you who have been here before, what's up? I'm bringing you guys today another box opening for Bakugan. I'm bringing you guys the Bakugan Battle Pack, Darkest Cyndius and Aurelis Trox. Um, I know it's a kind of old, uh, it's, it's, a, it's an old five pack, but uh, I've been trying to get my hands on the Darkest Cyndius and the Aurelis Trox for a good while now. And I actually don't know what these are besides the fangs or obviously, but I don't know what these two are. So, and I, I honestly don't know what comes in these. So I just wanted to open one up for you guys and see what's inside. Um, first off, uh, I really like the artwork that's on here on the side. I really like the color combination for Cindy's. Cindy's is one of my favorite Bakugans, just so you guys know. Uh, next to Lupithion obviously but he is one of my favorite um Bakugan. then it'll probably be Trox and then it'll probably be Drago uh Hydorus how do you pronounce that name um yeah um no yeah. you can see uh both Trox and Syngius in their open form uh, I mean you, you've seen them before so you know how they look like um Nothing really new because it is, a, like I said, it is an older. It is from like, I want to say like wave two, maybe wave three. I honestly don't know. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's like from wave two, but anyway, let's open it up and see what's inside. All right, guys, so here's everything it comes with it comes with Darkest Cindius. I really like the colors the purple, the black, and the green. It just looks really, really cool. 300 B power. I mean, like, it's, it's, it's a Cindius, but like, I really like this color combination. It's like really cool. And the Auralis Trox. It's really cool. I mean, nothing we haven't seen before, but it's pretty cool. Uh, and then it comes with four shields, three helix, three green fists. Let's take a look at the cards. Trox Ultra, two helix, eight, uh, 800 B power, one damage. It's not, it's not good. It's not the best, but it's okay. Uh, Syndius Ultra. Uh, shield and helix 300 b power one damage victory your point discard the card oh so that's what the blue one is tortonium tortonium two shields 500 b power two damage um maybe it has it's holding a shield battle core um baku core sorry gains plus two of the star symbol again if you guys can give me a link so i can learn what these symbols mean, that would be really, really cool. Then Mantanoid, uh, Shield and Green Fist, 500 B power, 2 damage rating. And then Pirate Fangzor, 2 Green Fist, 400 B power, 1 damage. Has a Green Fist, 8 gains, plus 1 damage, and I'm assuming Double Strike. Again, like, if you guys can that link to the symbols, I would greatly appreciate it. Molten Helix, 4 energy cost, action. Plus two damage and plus again plus two uh, plus double strike. I'm assuming just like Fangs or put plus one more damage. Repel Pyrus zero cost stops Pyrus. Repel Ventus zero cost stops Ventus. Smoke Armor three energy cost plus five hundred B power. And Aqua Shield two energy cost plus two hundred B power if Aquas draw a card. So those are all the cards. That come with it. Let's take care. Let's let's take a look at. Now let's take a look at the cores. Let's start with the shields. First shield, 500, uh, 150 B power, 150 and one damage B power. Uh, native 100 B power and plus 200 B power. The shield cores are okay. They're not terrible. They're okay. Let's take a look at the helix ones now. Negative 300 B power, negative one damage. It's pretty cool. Negative 200 B power plus 500 damage. <laughs> negative 2 B power, sorry, plus 5 damage, sorry. <laughs> plus 500 damage, that'd be ridiculous, right? Alright, and then Helix plus 300 uh, B power plus 3 damage. The Helix ones are not that bad either. Let's take a look at the Green Fist now. Plus 100 B power if Chaos or Ventus plus 3 damage. Same thing, but instead of uh, Ventus, it's Pyrus. And plus two damage. 
So the cores aren't too bad, too bad. They're pretty cool. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So now let's move these to the side, and then we'll open these up later after we close these. Let's start with trucks. So we'll close off the trucks first. The first thing you do is you put the feet right up against the thigh, and then you rotate it all the way around. Down the, the little arms. You can bring them down right now or after it's completely closed, doesn't really matter. And then you'll grab the tail, you'll fold it, and then you'll bend it again. And you'll make sure it goes inside the hole right there, all the way through. And just bend the head back and it snaps. There you go. That's Trox in sphere mode. All right, guys, now we're going to do Cindy's. So, for Cindy's, what you're going to do is you're going to rotate this leg all the way back and we're going to rotate the other one all the way back. And then the two feet parts right here, you're going to bend them. And you're going to bend this one back, and then you're going to bend this one to the side. And you can see, so you're going to bend this one sideways, and you just bend this one straight back. And then you're going to collapse the body down, and then move this section right here up, so it clips onto the both feet, and then it clips onto this little section right here. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna bend the blade back, and then you're gonna bend the entire arm section back until it's flush like that. And then you're gonna grab the head, bend it forward and down, so it's like this. And then last part, you're gonna grab the arm, collapse it back down. And there you go. That's Symbius and Sphere mode. All right. So now we're gonna give each of the bottom arms a roll, so you guys can see them open. Because obviously that's pretty cool. Three, two, one, brawl. There you go. Just a nice hand for you guys. Pretty sure you guys seen them already. Yeah, there you go. And then I'll close them up for you guys so you guys can see. So you're gonna bend the legs back, bend the arms forward, push the head down. And then there you go. That's Manson Lane's stream mode. Alright, the next one. Three, two, one. Fangzor, obviously. And this one's honestly super simple. You guys all should know how to close this one, right? Bend the tail back, push the head in, and then just collapse the body back. And there you go. That's Fangzor. Now the last one, this one, this one I didn't know was out, was the Tortanium, I think is, that's the name of it. Ready? Three, two, one. There you guys go. Tortanium Bakukor. Honestly, this is pretty cool. <laughs> The design of them is really, really cool. The shell, his legs, little tail in the back. The face is pretty cool too. I don't know if you should see all that on there. It's really, really cool. But yeah, let's just close this guy back up. Uh, push the head back, push the tail up, bend the legs down, and there you go. Really, really simple. Three, two, one. There you guys go. There's Trox Ultra 40. Pretty cool. Let's just close them up real fast. Alright, now last but not least, let's go with Cindy's. What I'm pretty sure you guys have seen Cindy's before. What's really cool about this guy is that. Oh, actually, you know what? I'll just show you guys. Alright, ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> yeah, that's right, guys. He holds the core with his shield. That's pretty cool, huh? Alright, so that's it for now, guys. Alright, please like, comment, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Thanks.